Here are our top five stories of the week. Number five. Ford leads three-year hydrogen fuel cell e-transit trials for long-distance, heavy cargo transport. Ford Motor Co. will lead a consortium testing hydrogen fuel cell versions of its e-transit for zero-emission heavy goods hauling. The project aims to overcome challenges like fueling stations and green hydrogen production, providing insights into cost and infrastructure. Ford's strategic vision includes upscaling capabilities for hydrogen vehicles and evaluating recycling for end-of-life components. Number 4. Highlane is expanding its H2 truck fleet and will receive funding of 25 million euros. Highlane partners with Iveco and gains DB Cargo as a customer to expand its hydrogen truck rental business. The Federal Ministry for Digital Affairs and Transport provides a 25 million euro grant to Highlane, which is passed on to customers as reduced rental rates. The funding allows Highlane to add 78 hydrogen trucks to its fleet and pay the full purchase price up front, making sustainable road transport more accessible to small and medium-sized transport companies. Number 3. Premier, Volvo Trucks tests hydrogen-powered electric trucks on public roads. Volvo Trucks successfully tests hydrogen-powered fuel cell trucks on public roads above the Arctic Circle in Sweden, facing extreme cold conditions. The trucks, emitting only water vapor, use hydrogen to generate their own electricity on board, enabling long-distance travel. Fuel cell electric trucks are ideal for rural areas without charging infrastructure, providing a zero exhaust emission solution for longer transport assignments. Number 2. ABB collaborates with Life and Skyborne on one of Europe's largest renewable hydrogen projects. ABB, Life, and Skyborne collaborate on South 2 Port Project for large-scale offshore wind renewable hydrogen production. The project in Sweden aims to produce 240 tons of hydrogen per day, equivalent to 1.8 million barrels of oil per year. ABB will optimize integration of hydrogen and electricity production using automation, electrical, and digital technologies to drive the energy transition. Number 1. Iveco Group and Nikola Corporation team up for next phase of BEV and FCEV launch in regional and long-haul transport. Iveco Group and Nikola Corporation enter a new phase of their partnership, focusing on heavy-duty transport in Europe and North America respectively. Iveco Group will assume full ownership of the joint venture in Germany and continue developing vehicle control software for BEV and FCEV. Iveco Group will cover the capital outlay through available liquidity, acquiring assets in cash and Nikola shares, while both companies work towards the energy transition. If you enjoyed this video please hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. We invite you to like, comment, and share with others who may enjoy our content.